Hey guys, welcome to the world world of innovation. Hope everyone is doing well. Today I am going to guide you how you can create and configure a dashboard in your Wazoo. So we are going to log in our Wazoo GUI. Currently, I have one agent installed for the Wazoo server and it is disconnected. Let me just start the agent. Okay, here it is. I am going to the agent then it will be appears to be active let's see yeah currently it's active right now you have to go to main menu first and see here the dashboard click on this and create your first dashboard so I am going to create the first dashboard I am going to use data table to display values okay we will select the wazoo alerts so in the matrices in the bucket we are going to select split table right and going to select column and next here you have to select the terms and select the field to add I am going to add first timestamp and select the order ascending and the size of table rows and columns and select the time and click on this update button okay if we select the rows This is how you can see the difference. Okay. Now we are going to add another value. We are going to use the host name or we can read the logs which values uh, we were needed and or we are going to visualize in our dashboard we will go to the security events and I am going to open the wazoo and select the agent host and ascending and the value for and name okay 
okay we are going to add another Um, so the next field we are going to select as according to our requirement I am going to select rule groups ending 20 and group you can see as soon as you will be adding the values the data will be more readable and more visualizable okay now we are going to select the timestamp and the values and you can see you can change the time filter from here and see the logs agent name what what is the group and what will be the time okay now we will add an other row and now we are going to select rule description from the ascendings description of the rule click on update button as soon as you will you will add the values and you will add the values in the buckets the data will be more realized and more readable now we are going to save this and name it as table monitoring save and return this is our dashboard for monitoring of agents according to our requirement let's check that our dashboard has been saved or not no it's just not saved okay we are going to click on the realize it just has been added in the realization we have initially created the realization if you want to create dashboard you have to edit add an existing dashboard we are going to select table monitoring and click on this save button and name this dashboard now the dashboard has been successfully created i have just mixed up the things initially we have to create the visualizations then we have to add these visualization in in this dashboard let me create an other visualization i am going to select pie chart for the wazoo alerts and click on this split slice select terms timestamp ascending number of values you want to see and click on this and name the label for your data you can see you can create 
multiple type of dashboards using this visualization now i am going to select agent name ascending i need 20 values and name that this you can see it is this is for the agent name and it's the timestamp got it now add some descriptions again descriptions ascending we need 20 values and it and now we are going to move our dashboard if we edit this dashboard and add something new we will click on this add button and select the pie chart and it, it has been successfully added at the position and location for your realization we are going to save as it is this is how you can create the realizations in your wazu server and dashboard in your wazu server hope you guys like my videos and understood the configurations and the scenario very well if you have any query any issue during this configuration you can comment under my video so please like and subscribe my channel and share with your friends colleagues and students until then, stay blessed, stay tuned, thank you for watching, goodbye.